Hello guys, good afternoon. My name is Sarafa and today we'll be talking about the new SafePal X1 wallet. Um, sorry, just took off the... This, uh, this comes like this. Let's unbox this. Um, this comes with this. So let's see what's in here. Okay. Got this we could use to clean the wallet screen. We've got this which could tell us how to make use of the wallet if we need help. You can scan this. And this is the link to download the Safe Power app. We've got three of these, just in case you want to write down your your passphrase. Let's see what we've still got. Okay, we've got these two safe power stickers. We can stick it anywhere, maybe back of our laptop, fridge sides, or anywhere we like. So that's for that. Um, um, here is the, the wallet itself. It's, it has the safe ball and crested logo on it. Uh, is it? It comes with a USB type C. It's quite handy, you see. It's handy. Let's see what's in here. Um, that's the type C USB cord. Which has um, safe power and crested on the, the cord. So it goes like this. Like this. So that's it. So that's what that. Turn up the turn on the S1 wallet. Turn on the S1 wallet, the button down here, button left. Yeah, it comes up. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. The back key or the button key, we've got zero and we've got the OK key. So the five key stands as uh, toggling the cursor up. The down key, standards toggling the cursor, um, the zero key, toggling the cursor down. So the side key is to go forward or sideways. And the seven, number seven key is to toggle it backwards or go sideways left. So we'll click on OK. Um, add the wallet start your crypto journey top right hand side is a battery icon telling us how many um, percent the battery is left with so click on ok actually i haven't given the this a full charge to know how long it it could last um i would like to recover a wallet you can choose to create a new wallet if you'd wish but probably me i would like to recover one so recover a wallet it's a swift money place uh, just quickly write it down so maybe I make a mistake and I'd want to clean or erase I can click on this maybe I just click on that so. yep Okay. Okay. 
All right, so just quickly write this. So that's it. So we'd like to create um, a six digit code so as which we could impute while trying to confirm um, while trying to confirm a transaction. So I'll just put um, okay, put the code two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that password seems weak. So we just have to go back and try a more different password that doesn't seem weak or easy to guess. We we'll use three nine. Three nine three nine three nine three nine three nine. This doesn't mean you should use this password. This is just for an example. You can use whatever password combination you want. Okay. So my new wallet is click save as maybe X save power. S2, click S2. I'll confirm my wallet name as S2. You're ready to use, um, your wallet is ready to use. Please add it to the SafePal app. Okay. So now I'll go to my mobile. Go to my mobile phone. I'll get this one here, which says. I can, uh, yep, open. So I'd have to download the safe file from the App Store. Get. So that's it. Downloaded. I'm downloading. So I'd open the app. Allow, I've read, get started. Um, security key three nine three nine three nine three nine three three nine three nine. Here, correct. Okay, so now start my safe bow. We use hardware. We're backing up the X1 wallet, so we click on the X1, allow Bluetooth to connect, start connection. So yeah, it has detected the wallet here. That's the available wallet you can see right here. So we click on that, so it's connecting. The code is 916290. That's the same code as seen here. Nine one six two nine zero. We pay it. Sorry. It's pairing. Connection on success. So it's turned on. If you haven't created a wallet, please create a wallet for it for connecting. We already created a wallet, so we should be good. Let's see Bluetooth. The Bluetooth. Let's turn up. Uh, let's turn on. Check if my mobile phone Bluetooth is turn on. Start connection. We'll click on this. It's okay. Let's pay. Still unsuccessful. activated it myself so I click on the password uh, 939 that's it it has successfully created my wallet and for us to cross check if this is correct I click on asset uh, come to BP 20 BP 20 just to cross check the wallet address 
receive okay we could see it ends with fb4 fb4 0x34 so it's correct so that's it that's how to create your wallet and um, also pair it with the x1 device thank you guys do enjoy your day